In this video, I will show you how to use the Canva website to create a book cover for free. If you don't have an account on Canva, you can create one for free. Sign up with your email, and set a password, and you're good to go. There's no need to pay for the full version. The free version will do fine for the work that we need. If you log into Canva, you will see the dashboard. Here you can choose which type of image that you want to make. I will type an ebook cover in the search box, as I'm going to make an ebook cover. You can also create a book cover from scratch. To do this, click on the Create a Design button, and select Custom Size. Fill in your cover dimensions, hit Create New Design, and a new page will open with the selected cover size. But in this example, I will use a book cover template. There's a big choice of book covers available to choose from. Just browse the covers until you for the right one that will fit your book. Or if you don't find one, you can create one from scratch. I will make a cover from a blank template, so let's click create a blank cover. The blank cover page opens in a new page, and now you can start designing your book cover. First I will change the background of the blank cover. Go to the color selection tool and pick a color. I'm going to make the cover blue. Next we need a title for our book. Move over to the text tool, and a list with all the different text templates that you can add to your cover will pop up. There are text styles for every genre, and they are all free to use. I'm not going to use a template for now, but pick the simple header text option. Replace the text with my book title, to keep it simple. We can easily change the title font by selecting one of the other fonts on the left side. Fonts with a little star on the side are only available in the paid version, so we need to stick with the free fonts. But there's enough of them. I will pick this one. Let's move the title up a bit. Put the mouse cursor over the title and drag it to the right place. If you want the title in the center, or in the middle of the cover, you can use the position tool. Now, I want to add a graphic on my book cover. I will do this by clicking the Elements tab. A list with icons and clipart will pop up. If you need a specific image, enter the keyword in the search box. I want to put a house in my book cover, so house is my keyword. A list with houses pops up. You can only use the icons with the free mark. Images with a small crown are only available in the full version of Canva. Here's one that I like, so I will select it and it will be added to the cover. Drag the image around until it fits. Next, we need a subtitle for adding the author name to our cover. Use the text tab again, select add a subheading, move it to the right position, and enter the author name. Pick a new color. Let's choose this orange here. I'm also coloring the title, to make it fit with the author name. The cover looks nice, but we're going to add some more items to make it even better. Go to the Elements tab again and pick the square box. I will add this box behind the house with the position tool. Click backward to move the square behind the house image. Let's change the color a bit to make it look better. Next, I will add another square box, and resize it to fit behind the title. Bring it forward with the position tool, and pick a new color for the title so it can be red. Let's make it white. Okay, we're almost done. To make the square behind the house a little transparent, use the checkered box tool and move the slider until you find the right look. I'm going to duplicate the banner, and place the copy behind the author name text. Use the position tool again to place the banner behind the author name. Change the title color to make it pop out, and make it in capital letters. I think the book cover looks fine. Let's download the cover image to our hard drive. 
Click the download button and pick PNG format for the highest quality. You may also choose JPEG format, but PNG is much better. Let's make another cover with one of the Canva cover templates. Let's get rid of the house clipart, and browse through the selection of background images. Whenever you click on a background, the cover will change, so we can see the design. Feel free to experiment with the different options. You can also select a photo from the Canva library. Pick a photo, adjust the image with a few mouse clicks, and move the title and author name. If you need a specific image, enter it in the search box, and Canva will come up with a list of photos, some are free, and photos with a small crown are only available in the paid version of Canva. Use your imagination, and experiment with all the different options until you find something that works for you. If you really can't decide which book cover to make, you can also choose a template from the list. Click the Templates tab, and all sorts of covers will pop up for you to use. Again, feel free to experiment with all the items. Add a new font, remove text, change colors, insert photos or clip art, whatever you want. All the templates are free to work with, so it's almost impossible to not make a stunning book cover with all the options here. The Canva templates can be adjusted to fit any niche. It's fun, and you can even upload your own photo and images to use in the covers. Scroll through the various sections in the Elements tab to get an overview, and use the search function if you have something specific in mind. If you click on the More button, you can even download photos from royalty-free websites like Pexels, Unsplash or Pixabay, and use these in your book covers for free. No attribution is needed. There are more options available by clicking the Effects and Filter links at the top, and you can also adjust, crop or flip images. But in this tutorial, I will stick with the basics. Okay, this is the end of this video. You should now have an idea on how to make your own book covers. Register for a free account if you don't have one already, and try out all the tools. And why not set up a cover design business on Fiverr and create book covers or logos for other people? I have another video on how to sell free logos for good money on Fiverr, and other freelance sites. Check it out, I will leave a link to the video in the description box below. Thanks again for watching to the end. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to drop a note below. If you enjoyed my info, please leave a like or share my video with someone who may also like it. Or even better, why not subscribe to my channel, and hit the notification bell to stay updated when I post a new video. It's free, and you will be the first to hear. Have a wonderful day, and take care.